Queensland researchers are on track to becoming world leaders on brain studies, thanks to the arrival of the most powerful MRI machine in the Southern Hemisphere. Nine's Ebony Cavallaro filed this report. Our brains are very complex and in this lab they're trying to figure out why in some people the different sides of the brain communicate so differently. One in 4,000 people have a brain disorder stemming from that communication. 14-year-old Isabella is one. She's had trouble learning to read and write. She's only just learnt how to ride a bike. So we think that brain wiring could underlie many different disorders, including schizophrenia, autism as well, um, perhaps other types of mental illness that you know, haven't necessarily been linked to this as yet. And they'll give us an insight into the corpus callosum that's never been seen in the world before. And for families like us, it's giving us um, the chance to see how these children will learn. Because currently at the moment, every child with this disorder is different uh, and they have different learning patterns. This MRI machine is the most powerful in the Southern Hemisphere. It's just been delivered to Queensland and will be used by the Queensland Brain Institute for Research to help people with common brain brain malfunctions. It means people like Isabella will have the best chance possible to reach their full potential.